Now let me give you the background of David. David at the age of 17 was anointed king. So the door of kingship had opened for him. But from the day he was anointed, the man was living in the caves for 30 years. Anointed king by living in the caves. But so one day he was in the cave of Adullam. And his brothers came to see him and his parents. David, you have been anointed. What are you doing in the caves? David was a man, a fugitive. He was running every day. So one day David discovered, according to the word of the Lord, I am anointed king. I am anointed to sit on the throne of Jerusalem and then the throne of Israel. But even the throne of the, I have not started. So David got angry. He said, lift up your head. So he gets. He began to talk to the gates of his enthronement. David got angry. He said, ah, Saul, God has rejected you. But why are you still sitting? He discovered Saul was wise. When Saul realized that David has been anointed king on his behalf, he began to consult witches. <clears throat> he began to consult witches. One of them, he went to Endo. So it's the same man that removed witches. He began to consult. Saul began having magicians, astrologers around him. Why? Because David is around. After David prayed that prayer, and the men of Israel, men of, men of Jerusalem, elders came to him in Jerusalem and told him, Sir, we know that God had anointed you king. And they took the horn of oil, a flask of oil and poured oil on David and anointed David king of Jerusalem. Saul was still alive. After that, Saul pursued him. He ran away. He went and lived with the Philistines. Bible says after Saul died, the same elders came to him and now made him the king of Israel. And then he made a city called the city of David, Zion. Listen to me. There are certain levels and places you will never access till you deal with the person standing at your door. Some of you, you are where you are, but there's the seat of enthronement. Where you are is not your place. Am I talking somebody here? Whoever is occupying your seat of enthronement, whoever is occupying your seat of enthronement, today I remove them. Today I vacate them. Today I remove them. Today I vacate them. I 